Hello everyone, I'm Scott, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to change your password for cPanel. So just open up your browser, any browser will do, and then in the address bar, type in your website, followed by forward slash cPanel. This will load the cPanel login page. Now if you don't know what your username and password is for your cPanel account, and you haven't changed them at all previously, you should be able to check the email you received when signing up for your hosting account. However, if you don't have that email and you don't know what your password or login details are, just go to the website for your hosting account and contact support and just ask them to send you a new cPanel password. So once you have your details, just log in. This will load the cPanel dashboard. Your cPanel dashboard may look a little different, but that's okay because the buttons are generally the same. So we want to find the preferences section and click change password. You can also search for change password in the find box that'll be somewhere up the top of the page. So I just want to click on change password. Now just enter your current password and then the new password you want to use. So here you can use the password generator and this will create a very strong password. But if you do use one of these, you're going to want to copy and paste it somewhere safe or write it down in a notepad because they're very hard to remember. Since I use cPanel a lot throughout these tutorials, I'm going to type in my own password so that I can remember it. So you can use the password generator if you want, but or type in your own. Just make sure that it's reasonably strong. So you'll notice my new password is OK. You'd preferably want it a little bit stronger than this, but as long as it's OK, that should be right. So now I'm going to just hit change password. I'm not going to worry about this option here. So change password. And that's all you need to do to change your cPanel password. This will automatically update for all the services attached to the account as well. So that's all for this video. For other cPanel tutorials, or tutorials for creating a website in general, you can check out my website at www.thewebsiteteacher.com. And if you're watching this video on YouTube, please hit that like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching.